New developments concerning a former Madison teacher who crossed the line with two of her students. She learned her fate today. Allison Marchese, a teacher, former teacher at Daniel Hand High School, sentenced today three years in prison for having inappropriate relationships with two students there. News 8's Renee Schmiel spoke with Marchese's attorney after her sentencing today. She joins us live at News 8 Control with reaction to this tonight. Renee. Scott and Ann Marchese faces five years probation as well, and she must register on the sexual offender registry for 10 years. Allison Marchese sentenced to New Haven court on Friday afternoon as part of a plea deal. The former Daniel Hand High School English teacher now behind bars. A woman close to one of the victims who didn't want to show her face on camera was pleased with the sentence. I'm glad that she got three years and I think that she should have a little bit longer. She's got her own kids and I would hope that somebody would never do that to children. Court papers say Marchese sent these pictures to a student and that she performed a sexual act on a 17-year-old boy. Her attorney acknowledges what she did was inappropriate. This happened at a very bad time in Allison's life. Her best friend had committed suicide. Her marriage was disintegrating. She was just extremely stressed out. The arrest warrant says Marchese shared racy pictures of herself through Instagram and that one of the victims told police he asked her to stop messaging him, but she would not. I have no hard feelings. That's disgusting. To hurt a child is disgusting. To hurt families is disgusting. There are now protective orders against Marchese, preventing her from contacting the victims. The positive is that she's turned it around. She's going to look forward. Her goal right now is to finish her sentence and reunite with her two young children. Marchese is not allowed to have any unsupervised contact with minors except for her own children. Live in News 8 Control, I'm Renee Schmiel. Ann and Scott, back to you.